Hello everyone, welcome back to Pabli. So in today's video, we will learn how you can create Asana tasks from Outlook email. So let's say that you receive a lot of emails in your Outlook account and because of that, you are missing out on some of your important emails. So the idea here is based on some specific keywords, you want to create a task in Asana. So to perform this automation, we will be using Pabli Connect over where our trigger application will be Office 365 and our action application will be Asana. So to perform this automation, follow me through the screen. In this video, we are going to learn how you can create Asana tasks from Outlook email. So let's say that you're receiving a lot of emails in your Outlook account and in those emails, you're also receiving some product related queries or requests. Now you're missing out those important emails because your inbox is full of them. So the idea is, whenever you receive a new email in your Outlook account, based on some specific keywords, the mails should be sorted and then a task should be created in Asana so that you will not miss any important mail in your Outlook account because now all the emails consisting of those specific keywords will be created as a task in Asana. So to set up this automation, let us sign into our Pabli Connect account. So these are the applications provided by Pabli. We will go to Pabli Connect and click on Access Now. So now we have arrived on a dashboard and now we will go to Create Workflow button and we will give our workflow a suitable name. I have named it as Create Asana Tasks from Outlook Email and now we will click on Create. Now on my screen, you can see this is a blank workflow. Trigger and action are the two most important principles of Pabli Connect to perform any automation and integration. Trigger says when this happens, action says do this. So we need to select a trigger application and an action application to do this automation. So now moving on to a trigger window, over here we will be searching for Microsoft Office. Here it is. Now after selecting the trigger application, we need to select a trigger event that will be new mail. So whenever a new mail will be received, this trigger will start working. And now we will go to connect. So if you have an existing connection, you can go with it. But if you want to add a new connection, so go to connect, anti-connection established. So over here, you can see it is connected. As soon as I've connected, here you will notice a button that is save and send test request. So if I will click on this button, a most recent email which is received in this account, the details of that email will be captured via Pabli Connect. So in front of you, firstly, I'm going to send an email in this account and then I'm going to click on that button and then you will see how that email will be received in Pabli Connect. So I'm going to send this mail from the specific account. We will go to Outlook and check it first. So you can see the mail is received. Hello, kindly let me know when the product will be back in stock. Thanks and regards, dummy user. So now we will go to our Pabli Connect account and click on save and send test request. Now you can see the response is received. You can see the mail ID, the send time. And over here, you can see other details as well. You can see the body text. And now we have got all the details so we can easily create our task in Asana. Firstly, I'm going to apply a filter basically. I'm going to apply a condition before this Asana task step because here in my Outlook account, I'm going to receive all type of emails and I do not want to create a task from all of those emails. I only want to create a task from some important emails. So I just want to filter the important emails. So that's why I will be applying a filter. You can apply different type of conditions within your workflow using Pabli Connect. We have selected our action application as filter by Pabli. So I have selected the label as subject that is product related queries or request. And I have selected the filter type as contains and the value that I want is product. So we have applied a one condition and we can apply many more conditions with the help of Pabli Connect. So we will click on or condition and we will go to subject again. And now again, I will go to contains and select the value as queries. So if you have noticed, we are mentioning the keywords from the subject right now, but, but we can also mention the keywords from the body text as well. So let us apply a filter using body text. So, and in our next filter condition, we will be using the body preview. So we have selected this and again, the filter type will be contains and the value that will be stock. So we have applied three filter conditions 
and now we will click on save and send test request to check whether these conditions are true or not so now you can see the status is success and the message is condition is true so all of these conditions are true so in this case we are only going to execute the automations when these words are mentioned so the task will be created only if the words like product queries or stock is mentioned moving on to our next action application that will be asana and here it is so now we need to select the action event that will be to create a task now i will be clicking on connect so you can add a new connection or use the existing connection so i will be connecting it with asana i have already opened asana in one of my tabs so you can see the authorization was successful so now this is connected over here i have selected my workspace as pabritudes.com now you can mention the project id that is integration for me right now we need to give the task name so we can map it as well or you can enter it manually so i'm mentioning the subject that is product related queries or request so over here you can mention the notes as well and due at that means you can select the time at what time you want the task to be due and due on means you can select the date so over here i want the date to be you can also assign this task to someone so i want to assign this task to ashi rao and i've selected it and now we will go to save and send test request so you can see over here we have received the response and now we will go to asana and check whether this task is created or not so now you can see product related queries and it is assigned to ashi rao and the deadline and the due date is today so this task is created in asana and this automation was successful not just these applications you can integrate a lot more applications with the help of pabli connect so if you have any doubts regarding pabli reach us at support@pabli.com and if you have any queries you can visit us at forum.pabli.com if you have any pricing related query you can visit this link so if you like this video please share it with your friends and colleagues and do not forget to like share and subscribe our channel